It's showtime. <laughs> Hi Capricorn, welcome back to my channel. I'm here to do your October messages. So I already laid out your cards, I saged them, I praised them. No, I'm just kidding. Um, so yeah, we are using the zombie tarot, the ghost tarot, the Halloween tarot, and we are using the Halloween oracle. So first cards we have here are the magician. So, Capricorn, it seems as though you are learning about Law of Attraction. You have everything you need to get shit done. You have everything that you could ever think about. You have the right tools. You have the mindset. You have the belief system. To manifest anything that you want, That you, it could be financially. It could be love. It could be anything. You have what it takes. You're the magician to manifest whatever it is that you want in your life and I feel like this month of October because you've already done the work or you have been doing the work you will be harvesting everything that you've uh, put your intent into so that's good okay then we have the page of cups so maybe you are trying to manifest having a child perhaps or you have kids okay with the page of cups here I see that um you could be trying to manifest getting pregnant, and if you are, maybe October is the month that you might be getting pregnant. Um, could be a son, <laughs> just saying. Um, I feel like you are truly desiring having a, a baby, and the reason why I say that is because, well, the magician is right there. And I feel like you've been talking to somebody or your partner about, you know, trying to, trying to conceive. Because we have the... Um, the Knight of Swords here, it's kind of like you are communicating, you're taking action, or someone is giving you the green light to try again or to do certain steps, whatever steps necessary need be to get pregnant, okay? If that's not the case, then I feel as though that you will be needing to have a little more discipline towards your children because... Some of you, some of you could be single moms, and if you're a single mom, you're having trouble raising your child on your own, or because they're acting like little adolescents, you love them dearly, but sometimes you just want to kick their little asses. <laughs> so I feel like you will be, you know, communicating to your kids, letting them know, you know what, mommy's doing this all on her own, his own, whether you're male or female, and it's kind of like you need to be more grounding, more I don't want to say punishable, but more like put your foot down, you know? So if you are not a single mom, then you will be, you're literally desiring, you know, having more kids or adding to the family. And I feel like that's something that you will be taking action towards this month. So you could be harvesting little babies inside of you, little pumpkins. <laughs> uh, you could be dealing with a fire sign because I do see fire here. I see more Earth, and I do see Cap, uh, Cancer Scorpio Pisces. Uh, we have the Queen of Wands, and we have the King of Pentacles. You have the ambition and motivation, the King and the Queen, working together to make shit happen. One of you, the fire sign is, is the go-getter, the action taker, the let's do it now type of shit, the creative, passionate person. The other one is more grounding. Um, let's do it this way, let's do it that way, let's plan it out. We have the finances, let's just do it, but in this way, you know. So I feel like both of you guys together, if you are trying to have a kid or add to the family or whatever that is, it, it'll be amazing. Two power couples. But I do see that you are um, having a little trouble deciding when to do it or which direction to take because we have the uh, chariot reversed. So it's kind of like, oh, I dealt with this doctor, that doctor which doctor is going to be best for me because I feel like this person is not helping me or this situation is tough and I don't know which direction to take or I just can't make up my mind on if I want to go through with this or not. That's why we have the chariot reverse. So I do see we have the five of pumpkins, which is the five of pentacles, along with the ten of bats reversed, which is the ten of swords reversed. So that's good. Because it came out with the five of pumpkins, um, there could be some kind of financial issues, okay, just a little minor, but with the 10 of bats reverse, you're really not stressed out about it because you know you can manifest or get that money back. Or maybe 
it's going to take a lot of money for you to achieve this if you have complications having kids or whatever and it's just draining you of your money like shots and everything like that to get it done you're you're doing it with these because this is something that you really really want in your heart and you truly desire so you're kind of like i don't care if i have to waste money i can always make it back so that's what i'm getting and then we have the queen of ghosts which is the queen of cups very loving nurturing okay you have what it takes to be a, a parent very loving and nurturing you you have a lot of you know you're very giving to those around you your friends your family they come to you for support and vice versa and then we have the knight of pentacles so someone coming in with an offer it could be a job offer it could be an offer of saying here this is the right person this is the right doctor this is the perfect time to do it whatever it is something is coming in to offer you a helping hand so i feel like this is going to be a great month for you busy 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 is what i'm seeing here um i do have two oracle cards here that came out for you the first one that came out is the veil which is the future okay so to me the veil of you know the 5d and the 3d are thinning out you're getting more into you know um getting in touch with your saints your archangels the spirit guides your ancestors you're helping them uh or you're reaching out to them to help you along your path whatever it is you're you're getting more spiritual is what i'm seeing here you're seeing a lot you're paying attention to the signs and everything a lot more then we have the card of forgiveness and this is uh reducing burdens so if there's anybody in your past okay that you had problems with i feel like this month you will be you know contacting them for uh, talking it out and forgiving each other so that would be a huge burden lifted off whether this is a family member you haven't spoken to in a long time forgiving them um because maybe you felt like they only came for you for certain reasons and you probably cut them out at one point because you just weren't having it or you just didn't want to deal with it anymore you felt used so i feel like this month you will be doing the forgiving you're going to be more in touch with your spirit side you're going to be seeking the right opportunity to take action and manifest you know becoming a parent or um, expanding your business and spending money to do a business uh, but you're doing it with ease you're not worried about it with the ten of bats reverse it's kind of like you know you have to do it spend money to make money type of shit right yeah yeah so with that being said that's what i have for you uh capricorn please like share and subscribe to my channel and i will see you in your next video